Welcome back everyone, welcome back to Let's Play New Vegas, well, follow New Vegas. We're in Prim, and uh, yeah, we're in the Vicky and Vance Casino. Um, there's Ruby Nash over here. Hello there, what brings you to Prim? Who are you? I'm Ruby Nash, pleased to make your acquaintance. Oh, likewise. My husband and I are Prim long-timers. He fancies himself a traitor, and I know my way around the kitchen. Uh, tell me about Prim. My mother taught me never to say something unless it was nice. So, I don't have nothing to say about Prim, for the time being at least. <laughs> it's a sad state of affairs. Discuss it with Mr. Nash if you care to. Just makes me want to cry. Oh, what do you cook? My specialty is a rad scorpion venom casserole. It's more appetizing than it sounds. Hmm. The venom has a sharp, smoky flavor, and it numbs your mouth so fierce you'll forget you ever had a tongue. Oh, brilliant. It's perfectly safe, long as you don't have sores in your mouth for the venom to find your blood. Cause that'll kill you dead. Lovely. Um, I'd like some of that casserole. Does sound good, don't it? How many red scorpion glands you got? None. Guess you'll be needing to find some, huh? Come back when you do. Yeah, I don't... Goodbye. Yeah, bye. What? She completely changed her demeanor there. <laughs> yeah, bye. Hey there. Yeah, I really don't uh, fancy that uh, casserole at all. Howdy. Howdy? Hmm. I'd like to open that safe, but... Uh, fixing things. I don't think these people will appreciate it. Nah, there's nothing interesting there. Right. I believe we can go back here. Oh, that's very easy. But it is locked. Hmm. I am hidden right at the moment, so... You've lost karma. Hello, Mr. Vacuum Cleaner. Oh, uh, there's a locker. Not really sure it's worth taking, you know, two bottle caps, but... Oh, well. Cash register. Uh, hmm. Lots of safes over here, and I think you can't really touch any of them. Ooh. Jet, jet. I have to keep looking up to see that I'm still uh, hidden. Stim back. I want that. All right. Ooh, that's locked hard. I can't actually open that. Yeah, you need a lockpick skill of 75. There's just pre-war money over here and such. 10 millimeter, 10 millimeter round. Anything else? Yeah, look at that brightness. That is much nicer. Okay, never mind that. Let's get out of here. Okay, so we have to go and rescue the deputy. And we have to go and kill the stupid. It's a full sunset sarsaparilla. And uh, the stupid oh, raiders. <laughs> Move along, please. All right, so I know there's one on the roller coaster. We should probably go and take care of. But before I go to the uh, to the hotel, I'm going to go into these as well. These places. Mahalo Express delivery order. Let's see what it says. Um. Well, that's the sixth one. Deliver the package at the north entrance of, uh, to the Vegas Strip by way of Freeside. An agent of the recipient will meet you at the checkpoint. Take possession of the package and pay for the delivery. Bring the payment to Johnson Nash at the Mojave Express Agency in Prim. Bonus on completion 250. This package contains one oversized poker chip composed of platinum. You are an authorized agent of the Mojave Express package and blah 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 blah. blah. Yes, you will be dead. Um... Deliver the package, blah, 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 bonus. Oh, this package contains two oversized dice composed of fuzzy material. Hmm. Vance gun brochure. Oh, yeah. One of the highlights of the museum of the Vicky and Vance is the authentic gun. Let's go to the Nash resi residence. See if, uh... Oh, yeah, it's this thing. Shut up. Um... Mail. Nothing here. Wall carton of cigarettes. This is a damaged robot. 
This is an advanced model robot with a reinforced frame. It is well weathered and appears to have seen a good bit of action. There is very little in the way of serious damage. Let's try to fix it. Now examine the electronics. A few of the primary electronic systems seem to be fully functional and the redundant systems are all working. If you bypass some of the primary systems, the secondary systems should compensate and make some of the repairs easier. Science 55 or higher repair uh, required. Some servos and gyroscopes need to be recalibrated and replaced, but it looks as though the robot can be repaired. Repair 65. Yeah, I can't. Repair with parts. That's a nice thing. Um, it looks as though as the damaged servers and gyroscopes could be replaced with the correct components. Three pieces of scrap metal, two sensor modules, and some scrap electronics. Um, well, I obviously don't have the rest. Don't have the sensor modules and such. Hmm. Casserole. Dirty water. Footlocker. No, didn't really want anything here. Oh, bottle caps. Ball cap with glasses. Okay. Oh, some rounds. Um, what a nice place they have here. <laughs> All right, let's get out of here. We'll probably come back. Vicky and Vance. That actually works. Nice. Trying to s to spot that uh, other raider here, that powder ganger. He's probably on the other side. Right, let's uh, get ready for a bit of fighting over here. So... Where are you? Dirty bastards. I'm going to destroy you all! Oh, there they are. Oh, come on. Seriously? Wow, I'm very inaccurate. Extremely inaccurate. Oh wow, this music here. I don't remember this music. That's awesome. Right, the head 33, that's not good. Ow! Bang! Lovely. He actually had medals. I think these doors are locked. And that's easy. Right, I'm going to save here. I am so hor horrible at this. Oh, science of 50, uh, 25 required. Oh no, I don't have science 25. Ah, what do I have? Um, science 24. Ah, crap. I forgot when I was leveling. What's our level? Like, XP, yeah, a bit over halfway there, hmm. Well, that's unfortunate. I do want to hack that. Melee weapons, guns, rawhide, cowboy hat, varmint rifle. Hmm, lots of stuff. A large burned book. Pre-war money, I'm gonna take that because it doesn't actually weigh anything. There's a nice little save here that I can't open. Hmm. Nothing else here. Pre-war book. These uh, intact pre-war books went for a lot more in Fallout 3, I remember. 100 each, if I'm not mistaken. Oh well. Oh, where the hell did you come from? Save again. Hello. Nice, one more, come on. There we go. Nice. That's a lot of blood. And a lot of stuff they have. Um, yeah, nothing else I want. Let's repair some of the items. Uh, the Beretta. Oh, you can... Ah, you can repair it with a 9mm as well. That's cool. Let me check that. 9mm has 8 damage. 27 DPS. This is 26. Ooh, the 9mm is actually a lot better. Yeah. There's less damage per shot, but it does have more DPS. Hmm. There we go. 
fully operational. 9mm submachine gun as well. Hmm. Alright, there we go. I should probably get that um, mod, you know, with which you actually have to properly repair the weapons. But then again, as I said, because I have the classic. The elevator is broken, but it looks as though it could be repaired. 35 or higher required. Yeah, but um, I'm worried about the classic weapons mod. You know, would it be impossible to repair them then? I have no idea. Mentats, bubblegum, and vending machine with Nuka-Cola. No, don't want to go up just yet. The water fountain, I'm going to drink, even though it is going to uh, add radiation, of course. What's in here? Oh, there's someone in here. Locked. It's easy. Yeah. Hello. Very nice. Ah, the hell I'm missing a lot. I need to bring my uh, gun skills up. Or just start using energy weapons. Environment rifle. Oh, there's a... Oh, no, that's the exit. Oh, hello. Oh, there's a lot of them here. Well, sort of. Oh, that's what I'm talking about. <laughs> that's what I'm talking about. Hello. He actually shot me while still being turned that way. That's rude. Wait. Is he shooting me or is he shooting that other guy? That was bizarre. Oh! Crap! Didn't see that! Bloody hell! Come on, no, 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 come on! Give me the, uh... In order to heal a crippled limb, yes, I know. Uh, right. Let's repair this, and also aid... Stimpak. Drink some Sunset Sarsaparilla. And then I need the doctor's bag. Okay, did that already do it? Um... No, wait. Status. Condition. There we go. Oh, yeah, that actually healed both of the limbs. So let's, uh... No! No, I didn't want to use the... Blah, 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 blah. Oh. I thought you could actually use the stim packs on the limbs. Oh. Well, that's rude. You can see I haven't played this game in such a long time. Ow, ow. Kill him, come on. Ow, ow. Not good. Not good. Stimpak has worn off. Another Stimpak, please. Where's the guy? There's two more. Ugh! Mm. Ow. Come on. Die! Holy crap! I need to eat something. Squirrel on a stick. More sunsets, Asperillas. Another stim pack. Where is he? I thought this gun was a bit better. Ugh, what the hell is... Did he have a weapon out? I thought he had a huge weapon out. Holy crap. Let me check that. Or did, or did I see the body there? Yeah, I think I just saw the body in a position where I thought he had a huge... No, wait a second! He did have a bloody flamethrower! Holy crap! <sighs> that would have been bad. I am not going to take the flamer because it's way too uh, heavy. Leather armor, no. Don't really care about that. That wasn't, um, hmm, yeah. Our low endurance is actually showing, and of course our low skill with uh, weapons. But hey, we are going for the long run. Uh, we are going for the, you know, energy weapons. Because that's just better. Scrap fission battery, hmm. Take a pot. Another convict. Environment raffle. Oh, I'm well. I'm keeping the weight down pretty well so far. Of course, 
It's not going to last. Don't worry. Let's check this guy as well. Cat eye. Mm, another varamint rifle. Yeah, let's repair some of this stuff. That's the nice thing about this, when you actually just use up the other weapons to repair the first one. Alright, so let's talk to the guy. I don't suppose you came here to rescue me. I'd cross my fingers, but my hands are numb. <laughs> you must be Deputy Beagle. Why, yes I am. It's a pleasure to meet you. I'm in a bit of a predicament here. I'd be most appreciative if you'd set me free. I hear you may have information on some cons that came through here with a guy in a checkered suit. Indeed I do, good sir. And I would be thrilled to share that information with you as soon as I am released from captivity. You can tell me or you can rot in here. <laughs> I'll set you free now. Oh, that's just marvelous. I think I'll be making my way outside now. The air is a little close in here. If you try to run away instead of fighting at my side, I'll kill you myself. Wow. I didn't cut you loose so you could run away. Stick with me. Sure, run away. You don't look like you'd be much help. Then I'll defer to your superior appraisal of character and prowess in <laughs> contests of arms and see you outside. <laughs> I mean, all all of the responses are, an, you know, an, what an asshole would say. That's not great. <laughs> but, oh well. It doesn't really matter that much. Moo. That's a Brahmin moo. It's got two heads. Right. We need to go to the uh, upper level as well and just make sure that this guy doesn't get killed. I don't think there's anything else down here. So, uh, yeah, we're just gonna go up. Ah, yes. Door. To the Bison Steve Hotel. I have to say I'm really enjoying this. <laughs> it's been too long. New Vegas, it's been too long. Ah, we're over here. Hmm. Gonna take the Nuka Cola. Gonna take the Sunset Sarsaparilla. And then. Hmm. Yeah, this 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 Colt is not bad. Twenty nine DPS is a th yeah. I'm gonna take this nine millimeter pistol for now. Where's my classic weapons? Because the 9mm looked completely different in, uh, in Fallout 1 and 2, didn't it? I can't really remember. This is very easy. Now, you can see on the bottom right there's a force lock option. Which means if you've got... Set, you know, if you don't want to do this yourself, you can use force lock. And if you're really good at lock picks, it'll usually be very high. So you can just force the lock and that's it. Conductor. I think I need conductors for that uh, robot, but... I think so, yeah. I'm gonna take one, why not? I think I need two. Oh. Oh, that's the uh, elevator. Okay, not really sure why you'd need that uh, shortcut. Ugh, hello! He doesn't look too happy to see me. That's a lot of attacks I can do with this gun. Whoa! Sneak attack critical. That was a sneak attack. Very nice. Yep, he's dead. Sorry about that. Where are they? Oh, I'm gonna take stuff then. Fresh carrot. Purified water? Where are they? Oh. Oh, they're upstairs as well. Oh, bloody hell. There's a lot of stuff over here. Nothing here I want. Nothing in the dresser. Agility and perception. Nope. I am not going to drink from that. You know, I always th thought it weird in uh, Fallout 3 in New Vegas. You can drink from these toilets and everything. But where does the pressure come from? That's That looks pretty pretty, actually. Yeah, where, where does the pressure come from? Uh oh. <gasps> Bloody hell. Hello. No, 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 no. Don't want to do that. Aha! He's seen me. <laughs> Aha! And then he dies. Very nice critical strike again. Where's the other one? Aha! I am dead. 
disbarment raffle. Don't really want to go there yet. I want to go around here. There's nothing here. Ah! Hello there. Mr. Convict. Actually, let me crouch first. Oh, it doesn't make any difference. Brilliant. Wow, this 9mm is brilliant. Look at that. Very nice indeed. They've got so much stuff. Stimpak. I always want Stimpaks! Holy crap. <laughs> oh, there's another guy behind me. It's a good thing I've seen that. Of course, otherwise we would have felt it. Stimpak. Come on. Oh. Hello. Come closer. Whoa, I'm not playing with that. Ow! Holy crap. That would have been bad. Give me the Nuka Cola. Ow! And one of my arms got crippled, I believe. Man. This 9mm is very, very good. Steady. Weapon spread reduced. Uh, let's see what got crippled. Why am I getting crippled so much? Wait, what happens if this is crippled? I think you get uh, minus endurance, right? No? Hmm. Don't rightly know. Alright, so let's check these areas. What do you got for me? A dynamite? Ooh. Hello there. What does he have? A rifle of some sort. It's point blank. Oh man, look at... <laughs> you know, I know people don't really like when you can shoot them so many times in the, uh, in the head and they don't die instantly. But I don't know, I think it's kind of satisfying to just shoot them in the head over and over and then see it explode. I don't know. Or maybe it's because I haven't played this game in such a long time. You're a cripple. Use a doctor's bag. Yeah, I can't remember what happens if you uh, get your torso crippled. If you get your head, you get this, you know, dizziness and such, which is kind of annoying. Um, if you get your arms crippled, your aim is off. If you get your legs, you move slower and so on and so forth. Um, but the torso? I don't know. You'd think that your uh, maximum health was reduced or something. I'm going to take all of that. Hmm. Oh man, what what episode is this? Four? No, five? I think it's six, maybe even, yeah. Episode six. And we, we've barely just begun the game. <laughs> but you know what? I am really enjoying this. And as I said, I hope you are enjoying this as well. I really, really hope you are. And if you are, then, you know, this, this is all good. This is all good. Doesn't matter if it's going to take a lot of episodes in a long time. We're just going to take it slow and enjoy the way. Enjoy the ride. Pre-war money, hockey masks, or it can be crazy. Pre-war casual wear, nah. Not interested in that. That's a big hotel. Ugh, that guy's dead. Ransom note. What does the ransom note say? Mr. Peterson, if you want to see your wife alive again, bring the cash in small unmarked bills to the Bison Steve on Tuesday. I don't know if that's before. Whoa. I don't know if that's the, you know, pre-war stuff, um, or not. Because I don't know. Single shotgun. Almost sounds like it, you know, unmarked bills. I mean, I don't think they're really marked bills in the post-apocalyptic world anymore. Um, oh, this is also locked. What does this lead? Ooh. Actually, it's odd that it didn't just uh, open it, because I believe we had the key. Mm, there's some uh, psychos here, which is quite a nice. Of course, you can get addicted. Wait, is addiction in this game as well? It is, right? Oh, God, look at this guy. He just went all out... And now he went all out, yeah. Medics. 
Oh, switchblade psychos. Was he? Did he actually kill himself? Horrible. Anyway, I think we're pretty much done with this place. We've killed all the raiders here. We've uh, released Deputy Beagle. So we can go down. That's what she said. And, yep. We can return. Did I check this area? I did, right? Yes, this is the... This is the stairs, actually. Alright, anyway. I will see you next time. When we go and talk to uh, Deputy Beagle. And hopefully... Do something about this mess. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye. <laughs>